everybody have a super quick installation and review video today previously I had the gearhead works extended mag release in my CZ Evo HP Industries just came out with two versions of their mag release one is installed right now this is their oversized paddle release the sides like on the gearhead works have been in elongated a little bit to help work the trigger finger a little easier on the mag release. They also have this version which they call the duck bill. It's quite a bit larger than the one that's in there. There's lots of surface to come up there and grab your hand in there. As far as installation goes, besides probably changing out the grip, this is pretty easy. You just need a punch and a hammer to knock this roll pin out. It's not in there very hard. You don't even really have to take the gun apart. Pop the roll pin out. HP Industries was nice enough to include a new roll pin and spring just in case you lose either one of them out of the range when you try to do this like I did today, but luckily I found both of them. So once you have the roll pin out, turn the gun upside down and I'll pull the punch out. There is a little, the little spring is in there, so I'll push it back and lift up, and that's where the spring is. This is the standard oversized paddle compared to the duckbill one. So put your spring in your desired mag release come in like this make sure your spring is caught on the little wedge it needs to be on push the mag release forward like that until the holes line up and this roll pin you can almost push most of the way in with your fingers get it started and then you can just tap it into place take your punch just to make sure you're even on both sides like that. Test for operation. Make sure it springs back and you're done. Just like the Gearhead Works magazine release, the HB Industries, either the duck bill or the oversized one allows you to more easily manipulate the magazine release if you want to do a reach and grab like you would with say an MP5 where you can come up here grab it like that or come up here pull out like that these still allow you to use your trigger finger if it's long enough my pretty short finger so this tells you that it's got extra room on it to come in here and release like that HP's magazine releases run right around 36 bucks plus shipping they're made from 6061 T6 aluminum and they're hard anodized type 3. You really can't go wrong with either style if you're looking for more positive magazine changes over the factory one. Especially if you had trouble releasing the magazine with the factory release with your trigger finger like I did. In this picture here you can see the factory mag release. Now the factory magazine versus the gearhead works. Now the gearhead works versus the paddle, and now the paddle versus the duckbill. As always, thanks for watching everybody, until next time.